Well, they they now know what the game is. Yes, the game we will be playing City today Banks. is uh is Dishonored for the PC. This is a game that Grimoth has played through extensively. I'm uh, familiar with the game. I'm not so familiar as to be able to guide you, but I don't think that you would want that anyway. Yeah, this is not going to be any sort of like super awesome go to pro run. This will be my first time playing through the game at all, folks. It's uh, it's rare for me to have a uh, have more experience than lethal in a game such as Dishonored. Of course, the second game is out, but uh, you know, in order for lethal, I suppose, to explore the second one, he might want to know the backstory that is the first. So let's go ahead and get on with it. We'll go ahead and start a new game. I have played through the, the tutorial portion. We're gonna be playing on very hard because, really, in my opinion, if you don't play a stealth game on very hard, there's really no dire consequences for not being stealthy so we're gonna have a brutal experience for hardcore gamers enemies inflict extreme damage and have keen perceptions and potions are less effective do note that this is lethal's first time playing this game but he's played many stealth games and he has that i mean what's the worst that can happen right repeated content I suppose I'm also going to be mothering you, chat, so with that in mind, I'm going to fucking... Well, I have no control over the mouse anyway, right? Because, excuse me, this is two monitor land. I'm only used to present one monitor. And if I alt-tab, that's going to be any key, and then everything will be ruined. <laughs> I, get, I guess with my new glasses, I can fucking read that tiny print. <laughs> Shit. Anyway, you have just returned from a journey of several months visiting other nations in the Empire to ask for aid in dealing with the Rat Plague, because that's a thing. You must deliver their diplomatic response to the Empress, whom you serve as Lord Protector. Uh, hitbox chatted to respond. if only there was someone else I trusted to send, the gun. so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. It's your responsibility, Hitbox Chat, to tell us sound balancing. Uh, we think we have that covered, but there's always the possibility that we might get overexcited, or maybe we're both wrong about it. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse oh, on us. Black well. magic. Okay. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague. Okay. <laughs> We're adults, I guess. We're yep. going up. If you want to comment on this, it's perfectly fine. Folks are used to me talking over it. Running on the pipes. And she's rising. I still think this water looks kind of weird, but it's probably just the cell shade. It does not look bad. We'll be waiting for your news, Corvo. All right, I'll go ahead and use this opportunity to first make this larger for Grimma. Don't do that. You can use the actual, like, hitbox, like, text size thing. The dots. Click the dots. <laughs> Click the dots. Okay. <laughs> There you go. Maximum size, and we'll make this a little wider. Yeah, there you go. And then, I guess you were right initially about, like, the game volume balance, although they did say, like, the dialogue was lower than, like, the fucking cutscene was. Okay. Well, yeah. we are responding to chat. We're being interactive. Let's go ahead and scroll it. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Grimace making hand motions at me. That's a... <laughs> oh, he's bringing in an airplane. 
That's not all I'm gonna make at you. You know what to do next time? Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. All these new machines are touchy. Welcome back, Lord Protector. Hello. Hello, sir. The spy master is with her, but she'll want to see you right away. Sorry, the uh, the Dunwall Tower text box was right over your face. I think they would like to see you speak. <laughs> Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Yes. Wait. Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. Do you have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. I think we're gonna go ahead and skip this. I went through this. You can hide up a, a staircase. It's that easy. It's a, it's a basic stealth tutorial. Uh, I will provide a little bit of basic lore for you folks and for Lethal, but for the most part, I think like details in the game can be discovered just fine simply by playing. Emily, for example, is the Empress's daughter. We're her bodyguard. Not Emily's, but the Empress's. All right then. Let's go see Mother. Maybe both. I mean, maybe is like a two for. Did traveling to the other aisles? My nanny says the big Welcome home. Oh, sorry. Lord Didn't mean to cut off your, your dialogue, but you ran over there. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the aisles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting was Unknown Gamer Campbell. asks if you're going stealth or guns blazing. I'm gonna kill people, but I'm gonna remain stealthy. What are you doing? I need the bottle to draw the eye away from Campbell. I suppose I can paint him without the cider. It's so already in truth, there. He's always close to the stuff. The painter there is Anton Sokolov. He is a preeminent, like, he fucking does everything. Artistry, you know, philosophy, science. Uh, he is a man of the arts in all fashions. High Overseer Campbell effectively heads, like, the religious aspect of the city. So Sokolov uh, is essentially, essentially, rather, our uh, Leonardo da Vinci. Yes. Okay. He uh, has a great bedside manner. We'll go ahead and leave him to his painting. You get your own squad after what She'll see you at night. once. Indeed, okay. I believe so. They're sick people. Not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, Your Majesty. They're... They're my citizens. And we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. The supercilious beak man there is the royal spymaster. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. Good old Hiram. Just dismissing us the way of his fucking hand. <laughs> I'm just gonna go now on my way. No, 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 no. And like Griffith was telling me off camera, me being here and him the spy master, he should know that I was gonna be here two days early. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. And he is a What news have you brought? Here's your letter. Always happy to serve, my Empress. Although it's pretty shit news. <laughs> I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before. Knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. <clears throat> Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Sad! Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, Wait, on the rooftop! <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> now we learn about com uh, combat. We have a right-hand attack, which is always going to be our sword, as I understand it, and our left-hand attack, which is done with right mouse, because you got to, you know, make it back and forth. Uh, that can be your offhand weapon, or a power, which I don't even know about the powers yet, but we will find that out in the future. <laughs> just blast him and then <laughs> get wrecked, nerd. <laughs> <laughs> Don't bring your face to a gunfight. <laughs> <laughs> and there's also blocking and parrying in this game, as this text describes. No, no DJ for the second. Like, 
like I, you asked that uh, and it wasn't answered but no there's no on stream chat lethal doesn't typically do that so this time is kind of lost that i'm someone who does that not lethal yeah and you're on lethal Emily, get oh, a little too early come on buddy Ow. that was a fast strike where'd he go I guess I just suck so much that you ran away. I, I think that was it. Like you, it's like Mega Man X. Like you lost so much health. Files. Like okay. It's funny because I did off camera. Just it took me a couple of tries. Oh well. We're not gonna be doing too much combat. If I have my way about it. Also, we kind of fucked up as our bodyguard. Kind of really fucked up. Not sure why they need help. Emily. Maybe so. There's no air. Corvo. It's all. Coming apart. Versus dead is in Emily find, was her. Find Emily. Dad. Protect her. You're the only one who'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. I wish you had a nice shot to start the combat tutorial. Oh now the guards are here. Lord us all. Look what? at what he's done. Now. Yes, he's killed the Empress. Got some mighty legs to jump to that conclusion, what Bella. Did you do Come with on. Young lady Emily, traitor. Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him. Mm -hmm. There's no other reason for way to suggest that it could have been anyone else. Like, so, like, naturally, when the royal spy master says, it was you, then the guards are going to be like, it was him. <laughs> but why? <laughs> and you couldn't even beat the man in the mask. How are you going to defeat those guys? <laughs> I know, seriously, right? So, six months have passed since you were accused by the royal spymaster of murdering the Empress and conspiring to abduct her daughter, Emily. Somehow. The royal heir. Now, locked away in Cold Ridge Ridge Prison, the time of your execution after six months draws near. No, DJ, I'm not playing. I'm literally sitting, like, four inches away from Lethal. I'm in the same room. Well, maybe not four inches. I mean... Four inches. Grimmoth has his own world. You just gotta humor him. <laughs> <laughs> there's Imperial measurements, there's metric measurements, and there's Grimmoth measurements. <laughs> They're much larger than freedom units. <laughs> Apparently. This is your final chance, Kovo. Sign the confession, and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time. And someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corpo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. You may have noticed that the Royal Spymaster had his own awesome full body portrait there in the background. <laughs> so the game's not even gonna like Should pretend this is some secret. This meal comes from a friend. It's a secret to everyone, but at least yeah. you three in that room. <laughs> I mean, it's an obvious conclusion to jump to. Oh my god, the spy master betrayed us. That's never happened before in anything. Nope. Oh, I tried to eat that up. Corvo, who we are is irrelevant right now. Just know that we have faith in you. Here's the key to your cell. Once you're out, head for the prison's interrogation room. Take the explosive there and plant it on the outer door. When the bomb goes off, run. Make for the river and lose yourself in the sewers. You'll find some useful gear stashed there. One of the prison guards will leave a weapon just outside your cell. And good luck. We need you alive and well for what's to come. A friend. Our good a friend, a friend. Don't worry, chat. Here I'm the royal spymaster. Already took care of that promotion. Guess I'll take this. Thankfully we have friends here. That is rather dark. 
probably looks really dark for you folks over there. Also, I can jump on things. I felt like having a jump before I escape. You know. Hey, you balanced it just like how the game people wanted you to balance it. Of course. There's my wapit. Here's a city walk sword. I need to stop leaning. Oh, there's coins. Also, I ducked down there. How'd I do that? I was down further than usual. Maybe it's just because I got near a table? Yeah. yeah. He'll uh, automatically, like, hunch down. Okay, cool, cool. So I can hide under that and they might not see me? I'm not exactly sure what the boundaries of this game are just yet. And of course, since you skipped the tutorial, it's now giving you the stealth prompt here. But don't worry, we're... I mean, this is like tutorial land in a way, but you could still very well die here. Okay, well, if we die, then we try again. With your sword in hand, assassinate an unaware enemy by pressing left. Uh, or approach an unaware enemy from behind and hold left control. I really wish it was right mouse, but you know, whatever. And uh, yeah, Holding left control is, uh, is important. Uh, that does take several seconds down there at the bottom. It has benefits. Uh, stealth killing gets rid of people, like kills them immediately. Uh, but of course you have someone who's dead. Whereas non-lethal, you have to deal with like... It takes several seconds where you're standing there choking them out. Someone could catch you while you're standing up. Okay. And fewer rats means maybe the plague doesn't get as bad, right? Uh, and the game does keep track of, like, it has, like, a sense in mind, as the bottom text describes there, of, like, how lethal you've been over the course of a run. It doesn't expect you to do, like, non-lethal completely, though you certainly, like, can pursue that. Uh, but the game world will react uh, compared to how violent you are. Okay. I'm not gonna, like, keep myself in any kind of place game. Can I actually change out the choke out button to not be left trigger? You can. Lock, lock choke. choke. Okay, right left. Hmm. Yeah, whenever you want to try and choke someone, you want to press that button, and if you end up having it be, like, right mouse button, like, your power and gadget, it will it probably end up be something you use regularly as well. It okay. depends. You might. And it looks up. like my numbers aren't uh, set to anything. What's well, so, uh, No, actually, quick access wheels. That do I need quick access wheel? Probably not. I don't. You, you don't even know what that is, so probably not. Right. <laughs> we'll go ahead and make that middle click then. All right. Did you want to reset like your powers core. thing back to its one normal default button? No, I'm good with uh, everything where it is. So All right. Okay. I'm guessing I can't really get you right. with those two guys Social talking. That would just be ridiculous. Come see the noble I don't know. Maybe the advantages of this game would allow it. Oh! Here's the learning, right? So I can grab you around the corner. Oh. That right there is a stealth kill thing. Like you can Attention. press left mouse button. The solitary there. wing is off limits to me. Yeah, I can't kill you. Unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Okay. Escort yeah, through the solitary wing. Well, there's something else that got on the side of the With one week's notice. That's why I asked. Oh, that's like, why I said it too. You can go ahead and stay in my cell. There you go. That's your hard enough. Do we have quick saves on this? I hit F5 and it did a thing. You can check the options to see what, like, button a quick save might be set to. Let's see. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, excellent. Perfect. Perfect, uh -huh. perfect, perfect. perfect. Lethal likes quick saves. It allows him to experiment without hey. any consequences. I heard you got eaten alive at cards. You're such a chaffer. Oh, holy shit. Okay, he didn't notice the absence of that sword laying there. It's in complete darkness, so you can't see shit. Alrighty. Is there another way around you guys, or do I have to go through here? Probably climb. It is a prison. There's not a whole lot of wiggle room. <laughs> Damn, I can't jump. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to Let's the try just slinking around the event outside here. Stay in the darkness. Dignitaries okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to lean around corners. Allowing you to look ahead without being seen by enemies. I'm going to hold you to that game because sometimes I've peeked out in other games and I've been seen. I don't care for it. It's awfully rude. What the hell is that? No, no. Okay. So he saw me. Let's, let's at least show I can parry shit when I have us on the right button. There you go. That was just for demonstrative purposes. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to give up stealth that quickly, but I need to learn what I can do in this game to really be effective. That's how all stealth games are. You need to find where the limits are. I thought it was in darkness there. Apparently I was not. And, uh, you know, that's how it goes. Huh? 
Okay, I want to see if he'd see me there, too. And do also know that you can be hurt as well by these folks. Of course. All right, just taking a look around here. Don't mind me, folks. Not the whole game will be this. I'm just going going ahead and finding my limits. Maybe it will be. This, again, uh, Lethal is playing this on the hardest difficulty setting. This is his first time playing this on. He's not played it before. He's not seen much of anything other than like a super cool awesome stealth kill video of like one of the DLCs that I showed you. Yep. Alright, so that guy walks back in here and tries to get me out. Okay. Then that guy turns around there on the right side, fucking goes to stare at, you know, Attention. his business. Will be restricted to the personnel you also know that his body had stuff, the little nick on it. Oh yeah. yeah. I took some coinage. Does that disappear if I don't do it correctly? No. Or if I it should it still be on his body. Okay. Like, he had a key on him, too. There you go, fella. Let's see. It might have automatically gotten picked up in the microphone and just blocked my vision of it. I saw the coins automatically got taken. Okay, so you had a you had a thing on you. Can I flip you over? It'd be on his belt. You could always just fucking, like, go and try and open, like, the door that it might have controlled. Sure. <laughs> Alright, is this guy wondering where the fuck his friend is? Doesn't seem like it. They, uh, they don't really concern themselves too much about that. Surely he had his own business to get down to it. Oh, that's not a door. Attention, the solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews. You see me under here? Unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Don't mind me, just through the solitary a chair. Wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. There you go. F can be used to pickpocket if you don't even want to deal with the guy. Okay, so that was just garbage. Yeah. 